Hi guys, welcome back to another video and welcome to my channel if you're new. Hi, I'm Femke and in today's video I wanted to share with you four new beautiful nude colors that I actually bought myself. These are by Catrice Cosmetics, they are from the new Spring Summer 2020 collection update and they are only $2.99 in euros each. So really affordable and because I'm always really really excited to try out new polishes and especially nude tones, I really love my nude tones as well, even though I usually wear like a ton of bright colors in my nail arts and so, but yeah, I really love my nudes. As you can see here, I already had a design on my nails for like two weeks or so, and I just decided to remove that, soak it off with some of my clips, and here I'm going in with my 99% natural base coat. This one is by Catrice as well. I did get this one sent out to me by PR, so thank you for that, Catrice Cosmetics. Um, I really love this base coat. It only has three ingredients, and it pretty much protects my nails from staining. Um, it's not as good as some other base coats that I have, but it is a really nice one and it's vegan, it's cruelty free, um, like they don't test on animals and all that jazz, and there are only three natural ingredients, so that's a big big plus to me. But the first color I really want to swatch for you guys is number 93. This one is called So Many Polish, So Little Nails, and that is so true. <laughs> As you can see here, it also says on the bottle that Catrice Cosmetics is completely vegan. I really love that, like, big, big round of applause for that, because not all cosmetic brands do so yet. I hope to see, like, big changes to that in the future for all makeup and other cosmetic brands. So yeah, let me just start swatching this one. This to me is like a very light peachy color. It isn't super salmon-y in my opinion, but some like perspectives might be different than what I see. Like everyone sees colors a little bit different, but it's a really nice light creamy polish. And here you can actually see the first coat. It is still a little patchy, but it is not bad for such a light shade. So after a couple of minutes, I'd say three to five minutes, just go in with the second layer. And as you can see here, it is like 95% opaque. I feel like you don't want to overwork these polishes by Catrice. Um, but if you're very gentle with pressure with the brush, I think you can get it like 100% opaque. But I felt like I still had a little bit of patchiness around the cuticle area. Maybe you can see it on camera. I'm not quite sure. But I have like a big screen while... I'm editing in front of me and I can see a little bit of patchiness. But then the second color is number 92 and this one is called Nude Not Prude. I love this color. This is one of those dusty rose tones that I love to death. I like if I could only wear one color for the rest of my life it would be this tone. I love it. It's very wearable. It's very like school and work proof as well, especially if you are working in particular like jobs or if you're going to a specific school. Sometimes you're not allowed to really wear bright colors or nail art or nail polishes like on their own. So this is actually a really nice tone, especially if you have shorter nails. It's not really an eye catcher, um, but it's a nice color. It's just very wearable, very neutral, just a lovely dusty rose pink in my opinion and definitely one of my favorites. So this is the first coat already. Um, of course you've already seen me apply the base coat but I always cap off the edges as well with the colored polish just to make sure that it lasts for a longer period of time. Um, I didn't really wear these swatches on my hand for longer than like two or three days because I was like recording a ton of videos that specific weekend and I recorded this, but it does last really nicely if you cap in the edges with the colored coat as well. But with two layers, this one is completely opaque. Again, I'm such like a raver when it comes to Catrice nail polishes and the next one was really nice as well. This one is number 99 and it is called Sand in Sight. I actually ordered this one online because not all of their polishes were like available online yet when I was ordering from my specific like local drugstore um, and they weren't all like in stores yet either when I actually ordered this one. This was like back somewhere in 
I think it was the end of February, I'm not quite sure, somewhere around that time when the new collection update was going into stores. Um, some stores did wait a little longer, I noticed um, they were like only getting in in the beginning of March. So do check your own local drugstore who sells Catrice if you're curious about these polishes. They're really inexpensive, as I mentioned, they're only like $2.99 uh, two in euros. So yeah, I love that. And I really love the like size of the brush as well but yeah back to this color it's a nice like kind of like a sandy peachy kind of tone not bright at all it's like way less bright than the first color that we actually swatched here but to finish off my little swatcheroo video i have a fourth color and this one is 94 a polish a day keeps worries away and i really love like once again i mentioned this in a lot of my videos in which i wear and use catrice nail polishes i really love how fun they make their nail polish names but not only for their nail polishes like their makeup items always have really like fun word play names and stuff like that i really like that it just gives a little bit more of like a fun aspect to the whole doing your nails but of course doing my nails is already a whole lot of fun for me and a little bit of me time and just time to relax as well but here you can see that first layer of that lovely kind of like peachy tone i'd say all of the colors are kind of like peachy nude pinkish sand like just look for yourself in stores what colors you would prefer um, of course you can just grab all of them like i did but i'm kind of like a nail polish hoarder collector i just love catrice so so much their polishes are always really good like good quality i love the fact that they're vegan they're really affordable as well and they come up with some really cute shades though but to cap in all of these colors i'm going in with this top coat that i actually got from pr as well it is a sleep proof top coat and it actually makes sure that your manicure um, doesn't get any dents and stuff like that you know whenever you go to bed and you just did your nails like an hour or maybe two hours before and the next morning you wake up and you have all like crinkles and dents in your manicure which is not a pretty sight this top coat actually like promises to prevent that so it is quite like a quick drying top coat i'd say i really really like that fact about it it's a little bit more expensive around like 360 or something like that but it is really a must-have in my opinion but yeah these were already the four colors that i really wanted to share with you i really love the fact that they came out with four very different neutral shades which are very wearable because not everyone is into neons and brights and stuff like that but i really hope you like this video if you have any questions or comments let me know in the comment section down below and as usual i really hope you liked it i love you so so much and i hope to see you in one of my next videos Bye.